Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Nine Souls. Last time we left off, uh, we were in this place. There's these weird little creeps that are hanging out. Um, uh, hi. Get up there. Bye bye. I mean, that's one way to kill them, so I'm guessing I'm gonna get some kind of fire attack to get, get rid of those things. Consistently. Uh oh. Whoop. Okay. Uh, ow. Okay. I'm a coming. There we go. Bye bye. Whew. All right. So, <laughs> was there anything else in that room? Cause no, we're good. Okay. Well, this opens this door. Good. Yeah. So it seems like fire is actually effective against those things, so... I'm guessing that's mostly what we're going to be doing against them. I meant to hold that down. Um, did I ever get that thing that just... Full control? No, I don't like full control. Like, I might just not be utilizing it well, but... If anything, I would want the one that just has it automatically... Pop. After a little bit. That'd probably be the one I'd be most interested in. Uh... Okay, get me over here, please. Thank you. Ow. Bye. Okay, sorry, this is a large room. Uh, ooh, there's stuff... ...down there. Um... Hello? Aha! Yes, you are who I want. Hello. Hello, sir. Enjoy a sublime eternity amid amongst the evergreen foothills. It it intruder. Oh, you're a puffer fish. Yeah. yeah, I'll just let you do that sound effect. Uh. What? Is it a? Okay, there's a big pause on that. That's the only thing I can think of is... Oh my god, it was like a second too early. It takes... you take so long to shoot. Has anyone ever told you that? There we go, jeez. <laughs> That's all I was trying to do. Transmutation zone chip. A memory chip containing map data of the transmutation zone. Further analysis can be done. Yes. Yeah, okay, you got mad at me. And called me an intruder. Which, I mean, fair. But yeah, god, getting the timing of that down. It was always so much longer than I thought it was going to be. Um, hey you. There you go, come on. Come on over here. Wait, you didn't die? Oh. Huh. That's interesting. Uh, I thought that always killed you. But, uh, that one doesn't seem to care about it? There's still more in that room to explore. So I do want to go back there. Oh, is this just this? This is just this. Would you look at that? Okay, so now we've unlocked these. Beautiful. New, uh, new elevator. Oh, thank you. And... Now we just want to go up top. So let's see what we can do. Did see you up here. Don't you turn around at one point? Oh no! Uh, that I did not know that was going to be a boss. Great! And that stupid archer up there clipped me with all three of their arrows. That was kind of obnoxious. Um. Okay. We can just we can just get back over there. Uh, pretty easy way by going through here. I didn't have all of my heals anyway. So I wasn't super confident about that. I'm going this way because it looks like I can get in there that way and then I would be able to take out the archers easier. Because, yeah, those archers being up there while I'm dealing with that thing would be a nightmare. Oh, there's another- go away! Oh my god. Screw you! 
God, I'm losing all my HP over this shit. There. Jeez. The nerve. God, three of them spawned? Oh my god. Okay, so that doesn't even connect over there like I was kind of hoping it did. Unfortunate. There is stuff there, but I don't think I can do that right now. Okay, so here I was hoping that connected somewhere cool. It does not. So we are going to have to take this other path down there. God, those archers with the triple shots are very annoying. Because if you're not ready for it, you, you just get hit by all of them. Okay. Up we go. So I just need to get back over there and I actually need to win this time, which now that I'm ready for it and prepared, we might actually be able to do. Damn it all. Leave me be. Get me out of there. Okay. Huh. Okay. Okay. Let's uh, get in here. Uh-huh. Shoot me again. Shoot me again. There. Can I get up there? Doesn't look like it. I'm gonna have to deal with the other one. Okay. Okay. Whoop. Missed. Um, okay, yeah, I definitely want to be over here. I definitely want to knock this down for a shortcut. You just healed, but that's fine. Because mostly what I want to do is take out your little buddies that are hanging out over here. My god. They're the most annoying part. You, I'm pretty sure I can handle. Your buddies, though? If you got buddy assistance, that's kind of annoying. Okay, so, and this, this gets me up here. Alright. Okay, now... Confident, I can deal with you. Okay, your timings are really weird, but uh. Whoop. Okay, that's a charge. Uh huh. Ooh, okay, that's the that's the shockwave one. That continues to go. You're doing it again. Okay, it does that multiple times, by the way. In case you were wondering! Jeez! Quit it! Gotcha. <sighs> okay. <laughs> the shockwave hits multiple times. <sighs> I probably could have beat you the first time if I was a little bit more prepared. Of course, I, I was missing some heals the first time I ran into you because I really didn't expect there to be a boss right there. <sighs> yeah, your timings were weird and you had absurd range, but... Zoom one chi charge when uh, executing a charge strike to deliver a more powerful strike that hits harder and reaches farther. That's kind of neat. I'm not sure I want to waste three computing slots on it, but that is cool. All right, is there anything down there I need to grab? I don't think so. I don't even know if that goes anywhere if I just jump off that cliff. It might, but uh, I'm not willing to test it right now. Okay, and here's my safety, should I need it. Let's get over here for now, because I can open you up. There we are. Okay, so what's going on? Aha, this is how I turned it off over here. Come on, swing. Swing, batter batters. There we go. Screw you. Okay, that's turned off. Turn this off. Oh my god, wait, that... 
that goes high. Oh, and that probably goes up to there. Okay. Okay, wait, we, we want to check out some of the rest of the stuff. God, this room is massive. This room is gargantuan. I need to get back and uh, use my use my, my map thing. As soon as soon as I hit another root, we'll do that. Oh my god, can you cool it? Oh yeah. Huh. Yeah, those dorks are kind of annoying to deal with as well. Ooh. They just have such a, like lightning fast attacks. Residual hair. A person's hair. Heavy metals can accumulate in the hair of those who have undergone heavy transmutation. Which ends up being harmful for both the person and the environment. <laughs> okay, well we got more poison. So I can do some stuff with you. Uh, God. Yeah, so I think now... I probably want to take that elevator up so we can get on top? And see what's going on up there? This room is just massive. Okay, that's a root. That's what we want. Good, good, good. Still not a new ability root, but a root nonetheless. Okay, so yeah, definitely want enhanced blade, I think. Or talisman explosion damage and water flow. Automatically detonate after short delay. Nah, that's just really good. Water flow seems phenomenal. I'm gonna I'm gonna give that a shot. And now I don't have to hold the button anymore to, to detonate it when I do my little detonation. Yeah, charging a chi talisman with up to three chi uh so lowering the risk, attaching a talisman consumes two. Talisman uh explosions convert all internal damage into direct damage. So I need to have two before I can use it, but as long as I have two, we can destroy things. Which, getting two shouldn't be too hard for me. I do parry a lot. So. We're getting there on the jades though. A lot of these are just sold from shops at this point. So, that's also cool. Uh, alright. Back to the pavilion. Back to the pavilion. We have a, uh, thing to do with, uh... What is their name? Shinong? I, I just know the Xuan Xuan calls them Anong. Hello. Give. There you go. Yes, please. Thank you. Thank you, good sirs. Good deeds. Great fortune. Long life. Now you're just spiting me. Good sir. Great advancement. Long life. Big happy family. Phil's home. Okay. We have uh, the map data for the transmutation zone. Oh, cool. I just nailed it. I got everything in the Great Hall. I almost have everything here. I'm missing one examine and two items. Okay. I, I'm, I'm happy with that. I'm very happy with that. Alright. Up we go. Hello. Anything from you? Nope. Okay. Uh, is there any modifying I can do? I could upgrade my pipe again, but... Eh. Okay, then let's go see what's going on over here. Hey, Schwan Schwan. Don't have anything to give you. Well, let me make sure I don't have anything to give you. Nope, no suitable gifts. Okay. Because sometimes, like, I I went there when there is something, so the notification swiped away, but I haven't actually made it yet. Oh, 6,000 would be really good. I just don't want to break down the Schwan Schwan coin. I could. I could, but I don't want to. It's a gift. Let's see. Yeah, that computing unit's looking juicy, though. That computing unit is looking quite juicy. Because I could put more jades on. And some of my three cost ones, in particular. I don't even know what jades I really have equipped right now. I think I still have the one that just gives me more gin and stuff. Which, at this point, I don't even really know if that does too much. you though I do have two things to give you so here's your hair num num don't tell me this is your hair Shenong yeah that was it 
Oh, I didn't have a transmutation habit, so my hair is toxin-free, which won't be to your liking. That's fine, as long as it isn't yours. I don't mind eating hair, I just don't want to eat yours. <laughs> oh, this is marvelous. Looks frizzly, but as smooth as silk. <laughs> yeah, I'm starting to black out. That poison hit just right. Yeah, so whose splendid hair was this? Probably guess from the way you laughed, but you're better off not knowing. Mm-hmm. On you! <laughs> Damn it. Gotta drink this. Avenge my shame. I refuse to believe that I can't beat that tiny worm. Slow down, you're drinking too much. What insect did you encounter? <laughs> <laughs> Village is in trouble again. You just stay put. They want to believe in their magic and gods let them taste the pain. Not like anyone out there will help me. What happened? <sighs> I need to make another trip to the Peach Blossom Village. What? Well, that's weird. Horse sign gym? Here you go. I want my health upgrade before I go over there. That's disgusting. This just tastes like candy. You trying to trick me? No. Those are the gallstones of a Deng, Deng Hong boar, which have a really high m heavy metal content. Mm. Mm, it's breaking apart in my mouth now. Better on the outside, but surprisingly sweet on the inside. Huh? What? You, you crushed it with your teeth? It's practically made of metal. Oh, I always crush hard candies between my teeth. God. Can't believe that. Sip. Mm. Uh, yeah, nothing beats drinking while sitting by the fireside. That damn bee monster giving me so much trouble, I sure needed a break. What bee monster? Did you bump into the Phoenix Guard outside? Oh, is that not allowed? Watch yourself. We're surrounded by hazards on all sides. Don't just run out on your own. <laughs> uh, that's nonsense. I've been all over this damn place. I've even been to that uh, filthy cave with the ugly murals. You can find a bunch of useless statues up there cl further your climb. Cave statues? You've been all out there all on your own? <laughs> Don't you underestimate me. That was nothing. Okay. Here we go. More maximum health increase. Uh, I think I want to save my gin. I really want that computing. Really do. I could afford it right now if I used Schwan Schwan's coin, but no. I don't wanna. Okay, back to Peach Blossom. Which we need to go to the abandoned mines to get to. Or I could just go to the Galactic Dock and go the back way. Let's do that. I mean, I believe like... I don't know exactly who I need to talk to, and I believe the Elder is like right here anyway. Yep. You fool. Who said you could run off like that? I told you a million times. Huh, the Divine One has arrived. What's this problem you're having? They, they set up tents and everything. That's neat. <sighs> Tell you the truth, we have not had day or night ever since those beasts tore the sky apart. Our farmland can no longer yield anything. Been sending our strongest men to hunt in order to gather more food. This foolish child, after learning of our arrangement, ran off alone to the Forbidden Cave to help. He was feverish and talked about how a big yellow snake bit him when he returned. Mm -hmm. Yellow snake. Dragon snake shouldn't be yellow. Uh. Has been several days of non-stop vomiting and diarrhea. If this condition persists, I'll fr it'll fry his brain. Please, you must find a way to cure this ailment. You must know. Eight man diseases. I wouldn't know where to start. What do I? Not a disease, it's snake venom. I know about that yellow snake and I know how to brew an antidote. Just need someone to kill it and bring its venom snack. Sack. Oh, Nong, my boy, so you know a cure? Is that that snake you kept going on about? The one you can never win against? <laughs> That's hogwash. It would have been easy if it weren't for those razor-sharp fangs. I know. Just tell me where it's at and I'll give it a try. I saw it slithering near a tiny lake inside the Forbidden Cave. It's a bit too vague. Why don't you wait for me back at the Four Seasons of the Pavilion? I'll come back when I have something for you. Remember to get the venom sack. You. I'll leave it to you, Divine One. Okay. I guess side quest to do? My child, you must endure. Yeah. Hi. So foolish, just like I was when it was just like when I was your age. Yeah? Okay. That's all you have to say. Good with me. So pavilion. And let's see what we can do. 
So, you said the Forbidden Cave. Is that just Underground Cave? Yeah, I guess being over there would have been the best one to go to. Of course, this is faster. So yeah, let, let's let's go to that one. Yeah, abandoned mines. And then we can get to the cave from there. And there's supposed to be something I can find. We will see, though. Bye-bye. Alright, so it should just be right up here. I've got to do this whole thing. What was the button for that? Was it B? It was B. You have to press up and B. Alright, so here's where it should be. We're around here. Maybe this is the one item that I was missing from this area. Oh my god. There's the giant snake. Okay. Yellow Dragon Snake Venom Sack. This is a venom sack of a giant yellow dragon snake that resides in the Forbidden Cave. It can be handed over to Shenong to make an antidote. Dragon snakes aren't normally venomous. Ecological hazards may have breached the damage boundaries of the livestock area, affecting life in the village. So yeah, this is where we were supposed to go, and that is the final item I needed. Yeah, because I remember looking here and being like, where could this item possibly be? So it was one of those circumstances where I had to like start a side quest to get an item to spawn in. Ah. Okay, none of that, please. We need to land right there. Down here. Thank you. All right, so back to, uh, back to Shenong. Whew. We are doing it. Uh, okay. Shenong, what's up? That's what I needed, damn it. How'd you get so agile? This makes perfect. There's really no way around it. Okay, so how do we make the antidote? Mm. Remember how I'm immune to poisons? I don't know the reason either. When I ingest poison, my body neutralizes the toxins. Whenever I expel, it ends up being an antidote. Give me the venom sack and I'll show you. Oh, ew. Ew. What? Wait, what? Did you just say you were going to swallow it and... Uh, no. Oh, I've never heard of mouth chewing wine before. I'm blind. That wasn't just chewing. You literally... Pe mm. Why are you making such a big fuss? You didn't mind the other drinks I brewed up. The other... So all this time, everything I've had with you was... Brewed in this manner? You so. Yeah, what of it? Like I said, no one brews like how I brew. A little too late to be disgusted now. You liked what I had to serve up at the end of the day, right? I... Well done, this will nullify that snake venom. Give that to the unfortunate boy. Why don't you give it to him yourself? <laughs> huh, no way. I wasn't the one who hunted down that snake. Why should I take the credit? You're the only one who can make this antidote. You at least deserve some credit. Sabine's ah, right. That's not how they think. Right now you're the hero and I'm the outsider. You can be so stubborn. Fine. But this is the last time I'm doing this. Yellow Dragon Snake Medicinal Brew. Snake Venom Antidote, made by Shenong, can be handed over to the Shaman, Heal, and Eat Villagers. The brewing process may seem unhygienic, but Shenong's brews really do have incredible healing effects. Alright. Out of here we go. Gotta get back to you. Seems good to me. Hello! I have Antidote! It's come from someone you know! Oh, you're back. I mean, the praise of coming- praise the coming of the Divine One. We are eternally grateful. And skip that last part. Every second counts when saving a life. Here's the antidote. What? what? There really was an antidote? <gasps> thank you, thank you. There's so few of us left, so we must try and- Give him the antidote first. You'll have all the time to say thank you later. His fever is gone and his rash is receding. Thank heavens! Thank you, thank you so much for helping a- lending a helping hand. Should be thinking someone else. Anong? Uh, oh, you knew from the very beginning. <laughs> also, what happened to your reverent tone? Did you forget to worship me? <gasps> ah! Your, your humble subject has severely wronged you, Divine One. Please forgive this egregious transgression. Uh. Oh, you're giving me a headache. Gods really existed. Why would anyone have to suffer? 
She just talked to me normally. Oh, I wouldn't dare. It would take little for those outsiders to destroy us. So that's how it is. You already knew the truth behind Peach Blossom Village and the outside world. I... I had an inkling. I used to be just like Anong, full of doubt, or should I say curiosity. But my awakening happened early, when I found out about those outside our village and the worlds beyond our world. Does anyone else know? I was the only one left, but we never expected all this to happen to us. Well, the situation has changed. You won't be able to protect your village by simply obeying us gods. What else can we do? Find a way to protect yourselves. What should we do? Hmm. Bye. Yeah? Okay, and I have nothing else to say to you now. So that was just like a little side quest thing we did. I do wonder if I have any updates with, uh, Shenong? Maybe? We will see. Yes, hello. Do you have anything to say about this turn of events? Doesn't look like it. Okay. But helping the village is still a good thing to do. So I'm happy with that. Alright, so. Hope you've enjoyed this episode. And I'll see you next time for some more.